Hiya, Josh here. And today, I am going to be testing my sled. I'm at Bake Oven Knob, which is on Blue Mountain in uh, East Central Pennsylvania. We have a little bit of snow here, not a lot. So I'm probably gonna be cutting through, but I really like this road. It's very curvy, so I can test out my number one priority on this sled, which is steering. It's also relatively steep. I have hit over 30 mile an hour here. We'll see what we get today. If you guys haven't checked out my other videos on the sled, you really should do that. I discuss how I made this sled, how I designed this sled, where I get parts from, etc. And I also have an instructable on how I made it. So if you're into that sort of thing, check that out down in the description. I have more details on everything there. I always feel like a little bit of a schmuck out here at 32 years old with a sled. But then again, I am going down a mountain that I have been hiking up for the past 45 minutes or so. And I'm hitting pretty high speeds. So maybe it's acceptable. Well, here I am at the top of Bake Oven Knob, about to send this thing down the other side. So before I do that though, let's take some shots of it. I'm excited. This should be fun. I haven't done this in like two years. Uh, first time out on new sleds, always really neat. was much worse than I expected. I was cutting through the entire way down and I really did not get much speed at all. The steering though, coming into those corners, it felt like it was on rails and these edges aren't even sharp. So that is really amazing. But man, it's bumpy. It is really bumpy. I think I need suspension again. Uh, I think I gave myself a headache coming down there. The good thing is I'm doing this again. So. Let's pack it up. 